Hi, and welcome to progress video number 10 already, I think. Last video, I started training agility until level 40 by fishing, as well as a lot of quests. But I am currently on hold with quests, and now I already have level 45 agility with a 28 marks of grace. So let's get level 60, or just continue here until I have 260 marks. Just put the game window back on fixed for these recordings. Maybe a bit more better, okay. Uh, update, 50 agility and then 72 marks of grace already. Uh, 10 levels to go. Quick little update, I just got 55 agility, currently at 143. And my current XP rate is about 16,000. That's pretty good, better than yesterday. There we go, if you don't fail this, then the end of the course will be level 60 agility. So from level 40 to level 60 in one go got me 250 marks of grace, so I will need to get 10 more in Sears Village. Oh my fucking god, do I need to get freaking food for this court at level 60? I'm about to freaking die! Oh my fucking god, man, I don't need to get some freaking stews. Dude, this course sucks. Oh, oh, here it is. Yes, final March of Grace. But since I have like 900 or just two laps more to go for level 61, be right back. Yeah, level 61. Slayer Agility, nice. Slayer Tower Shortcut, nice. Right, let's go to Berthope and buy that outfit. Oh man, 10 marks of grace for one agility level. When I was doing cannabis from level 59 to level 60, I've gotten, I think, 26 marks of grace. Then from level 60 to 61, it's Sears, I only got 10. For marks, cannabis is a lot better, but sadly, after you've reached level 60, the percentage or the chance that you get marks from cannabis after level 60 that drops dramatically so after level 60 Sears Village is the best one right let's go buy this don't buy five that would be problematic one of each nice awesome full graceful right what will I do now well, I have my full graceful, so my run rejuvenates a lot quicker. So I think I'm going to be continuing questing. That was my original plan, but I don't really feel like it right now, because currently I am, while I was training agility from level 40 to 61, I was watching a series. And it's a quite long one with 50 episodes, and I'm currently on the halfway point. So I think I'm going to be continuing doing Agility until this series is over. Else I will just put it on hold for like forever and I'm never going to be ending it. So uh, let's go buy some feathers and I just use the minigame teleport. So how do I get to a fishing shop? Why well, need to go to a fishing shop when you can just buy feathers from this guy? Oh, by the way, if you are interested in what kind of shows I watch, I have a My Anime List account. It is also the name of Slay Music One. If you want to, you could also just add me as a friend. I will add anyone. So, currently in my house, I should be able to put my Graceful in here. These six pieces. Nice. Alright, let's go fishing completed that show the final 20 episodes weren't really that interesting mostly repetitive and boring so uh, glad it is kind of over but I still managed to complete it so it was okay so the game that I've made during that watch is 70 fishing nice leaping sturgeon I've also bought uh, 10,000 feathers and that has gotten me to then 70 fishing also, one agility level and then a couple of strength. I can't really remember what fishing level I've started with, but I think something in the 50s. 
So that is some nice progress. I think at least 15 fishing levels. I'm going to stop fishing for now and I think I'm going to be continuing doing some quests. I'm going to make some use of that full graceful that I've gotten. Alright, lost tribe quest completed. Now why I have done this quest just only now at quest point 154 is because I don't want to lose the three hand pieces that I currently own. Because right now I'm going to be completing the sequel quest which is Death to the Dogashen. And therefore I will need to have two full sets of ham. Close crawl number one for bleh. Close crawl number two for a black helmet tee. I think I need to have the full set to be able to store it in my house. So I think I'm just going to be elking it. Also, I was very lucky, I just got this blue wizard roped up at my second kill and this will also be my first stash, no, my second stash, filled up. Nice! I'm not going to be getting the full set, I think, so this will just be a alchemy and let's go back. Oh, crap. <laughs> yes, got the hand boots, yes, finally. Holy crap, holy crap, yes. All seven pieces, all seven pieces. It didn't really took that long, to be honest. I only got three easy clues and only one thieving level. I guess I got quite lucky. Death to the Dorkushan completed. Pretty much just for the range experience. Level 33, nice. Next up, Wanted. Oh, but first, since I have some space in my armor case for now, I will be placing my full ham in there, which should be this thing. If I would ever run out of space in my armor case, then I will just need to remove my ham. Currently, I don't really have any use for it, but why drop it if you can just store it? So, wanted, what do I need? Alright, decided to complete one small favor to be honest. Oh, level 45 prayer, nice. Because I don't want to get rid of my mining helmet, which is my light source. And for the wanted quest or for many other quests, I do not need a light source. Also for the wanted quest, I need to have 20 rune or pure essence and I don't really have the inventory space right now. So being able to drop one item at least is an something. Uh. And shit, I need to go to the Lumbridge Swamp, which means I need to have a light source. Yay! Fuck me. Alright, defeated that bad boy. Quest completion, please. Give me some Slayer experience. Nice. This should be 23 Slayer without having even talked to any Slayer Master yet. Since I want to do a couple of Moritana quests, or the In Search of the Mirac to be exact, I want to have my Dremen Staff, because having a because having access to the Fairy Rings is quite helpful. So what I'm doing right now is just emptying my book and then using another table. And I should be able to get my Dremen Staff back in time. Let's close the door maybe, I don't care. Let's go! I have just bought in Varrock a couple of 20 Firebolt spells, that should be enough. Uh, I need to drop these two, I can't put those on a table. And for the rest, everything is allowed on Entrana, so let's quickly grab that stick. Shit! Don't have a frog teleport anymore. Oh my god, I screwed up. Oh, that's a fuck up. Did I mess up on calculating what runes I need? Again. Awesome, nothing gone. Nice. Good. Alright. And then also a nice knife to cut this branch into a dramon stick. Nice! 
I don't need this knife anymore. So let's continue with gathering the items for In Search of the Mirak. King, are you fucking kidding me? Dude! Finally! I am pretty much near Castle of Dragon. Who the fuck ever uses this? Six hundred attack experience, defense, strength, and hit points. That is way too mediocre, man. I just killed a comet one hundred skeleton hellhounds, although it didn't really take much effort with forty-three prayer. But still, six hundred—that's basically nothing. Give me the th oh sixty, not seventy-five. Well, it is two hundred forty XP. That's good. Can I sell these? Eight hundred each. Well, I need money, so there we go. That's one and a half K. Crafting experience isn't really that difficult compared to prayer, so uh, money is definitely what I need. But this will be the end of the video. Next video will be, once again, some quests. I think I have like five, six, seven quests that I am able to do before I need to do some skilling to be able to complete some more quests. By the way, if you want to know what I am following, I will put a link in the description to this. I'm currently just following the main tab. Currently almost completed all the quests that had no quest requirements. And right now I am here at get 30 them arranged for the Spirit of Elite quest for some more prayer experience. And then I can also complete all of these quests. Oh, by the way, the quests that are here in bluish that are the quests that require you to go to Entrana. So I need to complete these quests as fast as possible before I get some stuff that I am not able to put on a table or definitely do not want to place on a table. So uh, that will be it for today. That will be it for this video. Uh, hopefully you've enjoyed it. Okay, thanks, bye.